Hey guys, um, I, I've had a lot of friends come to me about cross-posting uh, gameplay and being able to uh, really uh, cross-post on Facebook and their own page, so like two different pages, um, while you know streaming their games. And I've noticed that there's really no tutorials for that, so I decided to take my own time to kind of show the process of making a Facebook page and uh, making it happen and how to make it happen uh, effectively. So the first thing you're going to need is Streamlabs. Um, I have an Elgato HD60 which is what I'm recording with um, for my gameplay and usually it comes with an Elgato software but the thing with Elgato is it doesn't actually allow you to cross post. It only allows you to post on one page or one thing at a time. It, can't, it won't let you do both. So if you want to do it you gotta get Streamlabs OBS um, I'm sure there's other ways to do it, but it's the way I use, I do it, and it's the most effective. Um, and so you get Streamlabs, and you download it. And then what you want to do is, once you've made a page um, on Facebook, I'm just going to pull up real quick. What you want to do is you want to make a gaming page on Facebook first and foremost, um, and that that's easy. Um, you should be able to click down this this. Um, this button over here in your Facebook and then it'll say a bunch of things for me now but usually it won't um, if you've never created a page when you click this it'll say manage page or create a page and you can do it through that and then you'll have your page so then once you have a page what you want to do to first be able to cross post is you want to go and go to your settings and then once you go to your settings you can go down to cross posting and it'll allow you to enter a name for a page and request or the page can request for you and you can accept it through here once you do this this is where things get interesting so first you wanna you wanna close everything down so act, act like I just I, clo I closed all my stuff down because Streamlabs is kind of advanced and you'll tend to get um see all these all these numbers and stuff there's a lot of good tutorials to fix this but the number one thing I found is once you close everything down um, you go to your temp file because there tends to be a lot of clutter in there that causes CPU usage you go to your temp file once you close everything down and um, it'll pull up a bunch of this all you have to do is just control all and then delete it and delete as much as you can but you gotta have everything closed to do that um, and that'll free up a lot of space. Um, there's also a bunch of tutorials on like settings you could use. I won't get into that, but I will get into just the basics for that because that's something that uh, tends to help me a lot. And I don't have the best laptop, so um, from going to choppy gameplay streams to this, you can see a big difference. So what I'm going to do is, well, let's go to the home page because that tends to be the easiest way to do it. So. If you go home and you pull up your Facebook and you have a gaming page, it'll pull up this section in the corner. You can do it from anywhere else, um, from the gaming page itself, but I'd like to just do it this way. So you go to live, and then once you hit live, it'll give you a bunch of options. Now, these options will allow you to do two things. Either you stream from this, or you use a source to stream from. Um, and so what you do, uh, it probably gives me the, it gives me the automatic, yeah, so it gives me like a stream key I can use. I know uh, this is kind of the newer model before it didn't used to do that, but I think it does this now. Um, but what you want to do is you want to come down and grab the stream key, copy it, and then come over to your stream labs now. Um, first what you want to do is you want to log in. So let me do that right now. When you have stream labs, it'll, it'll be bare. And what you want to do is you want to log into Streamlabs and then go to your whatever page, Facebook in this instance. And then once you do that, it'll connect you into your um, your stuff. Um, but I'm not going to show you guys my stuff right now, so I'll just skip that. But yeah, you enter in your stuff and then it'll bring you up to this. So then once you do that, um, you go to settings down here and then it'll have all these different options go to stream and then put your um, usually it'll have just your your regular thing pop up here and there'll be a button that says stream ingest um, once it says that 
you click the stream ingest button it'll pull it up in a format like this and you use your stream and you put in your stream key right here um yeah so once you do that you'll have everything you need and you hit go live i hope it can still record while i'm doing this yeah cool and then it'll pop 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 your feet up to the window here as you can see and now you have it should connect this to this but it won't actually be going live yet so um, now that you have it here what you want to do is you can customize it however you want you can go to polls set up questions for your viewers um, you know give it a title like test or whatever description um, put in the game you're playing for me it's usually NCAA 14 boom and then this is the part you need to do so you come down here you hit cross post and then it'll give you all the ones that you can do for me it's under dynasties save and then boom you're good then you hit live and it cross posts to both the the page you're on and your page and the other page that you're cross cross posting to and that's all you really need to do um, that's that's the extent of that from here it'll take you to this but you'll be able to see in my notifications that let's see it should show notifications maybe not but it is streaming in both I can guarantee you that usually it'll show in the notifications so it's kinda weird but um, let me see if I can if I can give you a good look yes yeah, so you can see here it says that David Marino is streaming on our dynasties and they're yeah, perfect so it's, it shows that I'm streaming and that earn it streaming which is the page I'm cross posting with so that's how you do it it's that simple um, it's not rocket science but it is kinda tricky and then um, if you look up some streaming tips on how to get these numbers down that's the best way but as you can see no frame skippage but that has a lot to do with my settings so and, and that trick I showed you but that's about everything you need to see um, if you guys have any more questions leave it in the comments but uh, yeah, um, this is the, the DA Marino, and if you want to check out my streams um, for NCAA, go to um, you can go to my Facebook because that's where I stream. Um, same name, and then Ernest Dynasty is where I co-stream, which is where a lot of our stuff comes from. So uh, with that, I thank you guys.